Today was the culmination of Clyde Gateway's Commonwealth Project 2014. We felt that the most appropriate way to finish off the Commonwealth Project was to host a massive Commonwealth Sports Day event. Fantastic, uh, and we're delighted to be working with our colleagues from Trinity High School to organise an event like this in such an iconic venue. It's been a year and a half in the planning, and uh, right at the beginning, we had six pupils from Stonelaw and six from Trinity who got involved and told us what sports we should involve, um, down to designing the, the t shirt that all the young people will have to take away as a souvenir of the day. Clyde Gateway's South Lanarkshire Education Services and also South Lanarkshire Leisure. We've all been working together looking at ways to incorporate the legacy. It's been a great day from start to finish. Um, lots of opportunities for the kids to take part in loads of different sports. There's a range of coaches here today who'll be hopefully representing Scotland in the Commonwealth Games. That's, that's really great for the kids, great role models for them to, to look up to and hopefully kick on from here and take part in sport in their school or in the local community at local clubs. Today we've had Judo Scotland assisting us. We've also had Netball Scotland and the Scottish Fissles. Again, they're in the same situation where they're entering top athletes into the Commonwealth competition for this year. We've had the Glasgow Rocks. We've also had South Lanarkshire Leisure athletics and rugby development coaches that have been on board and in hand today they've been great we've had volunteers and the teaching staff of both the PE departments and more than that the teaching staff of both schools has been fantastic supporting Clyde Gateway and this project. It's a fantastic experience and we really uh we're hoping that the young people will take away lasting memories of it, but also that it will encourage them perhaps to think about taking up some of these sports. The staff at Emirates Arena have been first class. Um, they've made sure everything's went smoothly today. And our local Tesco Burnside has been supporting the full event with a water sponsorship, which has been great. It was good. It was very intense.